Three people locked up tonight accused of this attack on a driver they targeted through a ride sharing service. Good evening everyone. I'm Jim Snyder. I'm Reed Cowan. That robbery caught on camera and tonight Metro believes one of the men in this video is behind a string of other other robberies in our town. It's our top story. News 3's Antonio Castellan live outside the Clark County Jail. Antonio, how did police actually catch these guys? Someone recognized the suspects from the clear dash cam video and called police. The robbery suspects are now here at the Clark County Jail. Some of the ride sharing drivers that we spoke with say the video is very surprising because they say usually drivers carry very little cash. Hand on the phone. Okay, okay. Give okay. us all the cash. This horrifying surveillance video catches the moments a robber puts a knife to a ride sharing driver's throat. Two other accomplices okay, okay. looked on as the crime happened in broad daylight. The dramatic dash cam video led to the arrest of these three men, Stephen John Warren and Matthew Amthor. Luckily, the driver was not injured, but these persons committed a robbery and now they're where they belong. Metro Police Officer Larry Hatfield tells us Steve Warren was involved in a string of robberies throughout the valley. Warren is accused in four other robberies where store employees were held up and then robbed of money and merchandise. He was uh, for a couple days uh, on a rampage doing several robberies. And the one that got him caught was one where the three individuals were inside of a vehicle that was caught on ca on camera. Police say this chilling video led to the tips they needed to make an arrest. The troubling images of a rideshare driver with a knife to his throat are very concerning okay, okay. to Uber driver Dan Laster. That bothers me, but I don't know. It don't make no sense. I don't have no cash. I don't, I mean, maybe five, ten dollars worth of tips. Laster tells us it's the dangers rideshare drivers face every day. He says cameras inside cars are a driver's best security. He's relieved the suspects are under arrest. I'm glad they arrested them. They deserve to get arrested. They need to lock them up. Again, that rideshare driver was not hurt. All three suspects are due to appear before a judge Wednesday morning. They are in jail with no bond. Reporting live, Antonio Castellan, News 3. Antonio, thank you.